APEC 2023. We're in the Infineon booth, and Ajit is going to talk to us about USB charging. So we've got we've got a, a charger right here, and it's got a couple of USB-C connectors on it. And uh, Ajit, why don't you tell us about this? is a 65 watt dual port. Um, I wouldn't mind having one of these at home. Uh, but Ajit, if you could tell us a little bit about uh, some of the components in there and how they managed to get it so small and what your components do. So absolutely. So uh, thank you. Thank you for this opportunity to talk to you. Uh, we are talking to you about this 65 watt uh, reference solution design, mm -hmm. which uh, we provide as a complete solution with a lot of Infineon bomb on it for our customers to go and build the charger from scratch. right? So uh, this, this consists of a primary side controller, a secondary side controller, and a USB PD controller in a two chip integrated solution, mm -hmm. which enables customers to make a very, very, very uh, compact design, followed by a CCG7D controller, which actually enables you to do multi-port operation. And so with this compact uh, controller design and using our uh, Infineon Cool GAN on, on in this design, enables a complete bomb for our customers. With, with our uh, uh, technology for enabling QR flyback controllers and uh, doing ZVS, zero voltage switching, we are able to get to very high efficiencies of 93 plus percent, right? So what this enables is for, uh, uh, in our terms, we are working in this market to enable our vision of decarbonization and digitalization. Uh, we are achieving very high efficiencies, in aiming at uh, reducing uh, the overall power consumption and also uh, moving into the USB-C chargers which enables customers to eliminate so many different uh, cables, so many different connectors and make it a universal solution. So that enables to reduce e-waste as well. Those are our main goals in, in this market. Yeah. So the, some of these components, some of these uh, controllers that you've got are able to make use smaller magnetics so how does that how does that work so the goal would be to increase how quick how high we can switch because mm -hmm. in, in in terms of the magnetics the transformer plays the key role of taking a very high ac power and storing it in the magnetic and uh, pushing it to the secondary side so if we can switch much faster you're able to send smaller packets of energy from the primary side to the secondary side and by using uh, higher switching frequencies we can get to much smaller transformers. Okay, thank you very much, Ajit.